Sony, wasara tunuk waga kima samad singa within mapamanai. The organization Satya Gaveshake filed two cases before the Inspector General of Police today. The first against Cabinet Co spokesperson Dr. Rajita Senaratna for making provocative statements that arouse disharmony among various ethnicities. The other against Minister of Education in the Northern Province, Kandaya Sarveswaran, who decided to lower the national flag to half mast. In the meantime, remarks made by Minister Dr. Rajita Senaratna. Drew various opinion from politicians today. If you can't praise the victory in the war, keep quiet. Today they speak for the LTTE terrorists. Sinhala, Tamil and Muslim communities live freely today because of the liberation won by war heroes. What we understand from what Minister Rajita Senaratna says is that he became a witness in the cause to undermine the war in Geneva. We question the government as to whether it accepts this statement. The LTTE is their relation. When a thief or a murderer dies, we remember them and engage in religious observances. But we see more of a political move in this action. It was those so-called children referred to by Rajita Sena Ratna who killed the fathers of Sajid Premadas and Navin Desanayaka. It was those children who killed innocent devotees who were in front of the Sri Mahabodhi and attacked the temple of the tooth relic of Lord Buddha. Today being the National War Heroes Day, we express our gratitude to the armed forces and the security establishment that pioneered the defeat of terrorism and thereby secured the territorial integrity, sovereignty, political independence and democracy of Sri Lanka. There is a great difference between certain measures taken by the LTTE terrorists and JVP. LTTE committed crimes considered as war crimes by the international community, such as murdering civilians, chasing them away from villages, using people as a human shield. We completely deny the fact that civilians were killed by our security forces. We see it as an unfair statement made to the forces and the people of the country. Today is an important day. Terrorism was defeated and the war ended. We should remember all those who were dedicated to give leadership to try forces and people who lost their lives since the beginning of this war. We insist the president of this country as the chief of the tri forces to make a statement that what Rajita Senaratna said is wrong. We don't accept it. If someone lights up a candle in remembrance of their beloved, I can't say it's wrong. I don't know if those who celebrate are civilians or terrorists. We see the celebration of terrorism which is buried as aiding terrorism. I don't think that the LTT, which is considered as one of the most cruel terrorist organizations in the world, should be commemorated. Whatever the stance of the party is, I refuse the notion of empowering such an organization.